Hello guys, how's it going? My name is Colin and welcome to this video. Today we're on Age of Wu Shu and calm down, I know what everyone's thinking. I have not quit Age of Wuling, I'm just, again, trying something new. Uh, I always wanted to try Wu Shu, but I never quite got into it. Mainly because of the fact that I always thought that it was kind of an empty and ghostly game. Um, about my last Age of Wulin video, or Age of Wushu video, it was kind of both, because I compared Age of Wulin and Age of Wushu in one video, and I need to address that it was not made to attack Age of Wushu, it was just made to kind of compare it, and I can tell you right now that my comparison was a little bit inaccurate. Uh, when I say inaccurate, I mean, of course, that I was kind of unfair. Meaning that I was on in a very reasonable time on Age of Willing, but I was on in a very late, in the middle of the night, in a very early morning time in Age of Wushu. So it was, uh, of course, of course, it was certainly not a time where a lot of people plays. But um, having put a little, little bit more time into this game, I have noticed that um, uh, I have noticed that there are many players. In fact, I have noticed a lot more players in Chengdu than I have in uh, on Age of Wushu than I have on, uh, Age of, in Age of Wulin in Chengdu. So therefore, I need to apologize for my Age of Wushu players. I did not know that, but of course, I have noticed that um, Age of Wushu still is kind of congested if you like everyone is pushed into one place uh however age of woolen if you go to certain cities you still see a lot of people in each of those cities they're kind of more spread out however age of, Wu uh, age of wushu you don't see that i've gone i've gone to many cities around the game and i still struggle to find uh, I still try to struggle to find a lot of people in each city. Many, most cities, in fact, are empty. Uh, it's only Chengdu and Suzhou and uh, Yanyu Villa and stuff and cities like that who are a bit populated. Other than that, I still find out that they they, they still have a overall less uh, uh, how can I say expansion of their players. It, the players really uh, basically stay in the same place a lot more than they do in Wulin. Um, as you guys are seeing right now, it's um, a very early morning in the United States. I think it's like 6, um, 6 a.m. in the morning. Let me check that. Uh, it is, yeah, almost 6 a.m. in the morning at, at the time of this video in the U.S. And still, I I found some people I can do TP with. Yeah, <laughs> very interesting. Um, so... I'm basically right now just chilling, relaxing, all cool, you know, um, doing my TP, and I thought I should make make this video due to the fact that many people were not aware of the fact that um, Age of Wushu and Age of Wulin has very, very significant uh, differences. Uh, the thing with Age of Wushu, as I've said a million times, and I still need to repeat it, is the fact that it is a lot more updated. Age of Wushu got Skyladder approximately, I think it was one one year ago maybe, I'm not sure, don't quote me on that, I'm not sure, but I have, I have a feeling I think it's one year ago, uh, maybe less, maybe, I don't think it's more, maybe less, I, I, I don't know, someone correct me on that, uh, but it has been a long time on Age of Wushu, and Age of Wulin just recently got Skyladder. I think, and I'm quite sure that Age of Wushu is, in general, approximately one year in front of Age of Wulin, which is a lot for two extremely similar games. In fact, they're the same game, just that Age of Wushu is a lot more updated, a lot less buggy, and generally a lot nicer to play. Uh, when I say nicer to play, of course, keep in mind that I mean that um, it is a lot more... It, it makes a lot more sense. It's not very... Um, uh, repetitive. Age of Wooling is very repetitive. Since the lack of updates, you don't really see a lot of uh, don't really see a lot of change in the game as much as you see on Age of Wool Shoe. Um, I won't see. I, I, again, I've put more time into Age of Wulin, so I know a bit more about Age of Wulin than I know about Age of Wushu. So I think that I should probably play this game for a little bit longer before I take, yeah, kind of take a conclusion uh, before I draw a conclusion. And um, yeah, until next time, I will try to um, I'll try to put more time into it and give my give my uh, my two cents on it uh, later on. 
So thank you guys for watching. It's been a pleasure making this video. Uh, if you guys can hit that follow button, uh, no, it's not the follow button, is it? Uh, if you guys can hit that follow button on my Twitch, uh, or you guys can hit that subscribe button on my YouTube or like my videos. And if you if you if you want to leave a comment, and yeah, that's basically it. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys next time. Peace.